I'm pregnant. This is the second pregnancy test that I took and they both say positive. What am I gonna do? I've gotta pack my things. My parents are going to kill me. My boyfriend already got shipped to boarding school. What do I bring? I've never run away from home before, but let's see, jackets, might be cold. Picture, pictures. Boyfriend, can't forget that. And obviously I'll need some makeup. It should be good. If my parents think that I am running away, there's no way they'll kick me out and then they'll help me raise the baby. So here, oh, one more thing. I'm gonna need food. Okay, food. Yeah. It should be good. Oh no, they must have found my pregnancy test. I gotta get out of here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stop it right there, young lady. Rebecca, is this yours? What, what is all this noise? Your 16-year-old daughter is pregnant. Is this true? Is this yours? Yes, that is my pregnancy test. I am 16 and pregnant. I'm gonna raise this baby on my own. I don't need your health or your money or the food. If you're such an adult and ready to have a baby, then maybe you're ready to be on your own. But then I'm gonna be pregnant and homeless. There has to be another way. Look, look, you're already packed anyway, so let's just make this permanent. Out you go. What? Fine, I'll leave, and I'm never coming back. Is this necessary? This is it. This is what we have no, to do. No. This is what we have to do. Please. I'm leaving. Don't let the door hit you, Rebecca. You'll never see me again, or the baby. This is the only way to handle it. You're gonna regret this. I didn't think my parents were actually gonna kick me out and now I really will be pregnant and homeless. But wait a second, they kicked me out of the house but we have a tiny house. I could just live at the tiny house. Yes, I'll do that. Okay, so this tiny house is a lot tinier than my room but it will do for now until my parents obviously change their mind. But right now I am craving a peanut butter and what am I supposed to do? I don't have a knife. How do you make a peanut butter sandwich without a knife? Or a chef? I'm just gonna sneak into the house, grab a knife, they'll never know. Making pies it smells so good. Yes, I just still can't believe you kicked our daughter out. She is not equipped to be homeless. Yeah. But look, look at what we've done for her. We've given her such a cushy lifestyle. Cushy life. And look how she ended up. Look at what she did with her life. She needs to know that the real world is hard. And <laughs> Rebecca? Please? What are you doing in here? No, no. Jesus. You're not supposed to be here. Young lady, where are you going? I got it. Oh no. Back. Oh no. Tiny house. Wait, 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 wait. No. No. Please, sweetie. No, I'm not moving out of the tiny house. Who's he calling? No, don't call them. Yep, I'm gonna have to. She's locked herself in. What are we gonna do? Don't yes, do neighborhood security. We have an emergency Stop. right now. We have somebody that has locked themselves into our tiny house. We need them removed from the property immediately. No, I'm gonna be homeless, Daddy. Daddy, Daddy, don't. They're on their way. They're on their way. They're on their way. This is necessary. Look at her. She's taking over our house. No. No. No, if you're gonna be pregnant, you'll be pregnant and homeless. <laughs> no. Let me go! <gasps> yeah, come back here. We're calling the police. I can't believe my mom and dad are making me homeless. What am I supposed to do now? Wait, I'm not homeless. I have a pink Jeep. I can just live in my pink Jeep! <laughs> Why didn't I think of this before? Time to go shopping. Oh, here? That way. Okay, I should be back pretty quick. I just have to buy a few things to fit in the suitcase and feel free to wash my car. I mean, I'm gonna be in it a lot more lately. So, see ya! Lady, I'm not valet, but I guess I got a new car. <laughs> Excuse me, I forgot something. I forgot something. Hey! He just took my car! Now I'm officially homeless! Damn no, I mean, I've been pulling her out. It just takes one to touch me. What are you trying to do? Oh, oh, oh. Hey, hello! Yes. If you haven't been able to tell, I am pregnant and now homeless. My Jeep was stolen. I know, I know. I'm sorry. I had to keep her in the program. Look how long it was going. Like, we just need to figure out what's happening. She needs to beat this program. What's weird is whoever built this program made you guys as my parents. Yeah, did you create this, Daniel? And why do I have to beat this program again? Yeah, I've been working closely with someone. Who he won't say. And they have evidence that says that we need to go inside these programs because we'll find clues on how to stop the Candy Queen's grand finale. Yeah. The Candy Queen is, like, planning something huge. Or this is just a trap. So how? Do I beat this program? Okay, in order to beat this program, you need to find success in life. Like right now, you're at your 
lowest point. So you need to pull yourself out and get out of this rut and figure out how to raise this baby properly. Okay, well I guess the first thing is finding a place to live since I don't have a Jeep anymore. All right, here we go. Good luck being homeless. <sighs> I can't believe my parents did this to me. Now I'm actually homeless and pregnant. How am I supposed to beat this program if I can't even be successful? Okay, it looks like Rebecca is in the woods. She's really homeless. Well, I need to figure out something to do for this baby. I am really hungry. When's the last time I ate? Must have been before that guy stole my Jeep. I can't believe he did that. There's a garbage can over there. Oh no. I never thought I would do this, but maybe there's something in there that someone didn't touch. Oh no. What happens next might be shocking. Let's see. Old sandwich. Can't eat an old sandwich. Old eggs? How am I supposed to cook eggs here? I mean, Jack in the Box it was kind of delicious. There's some curly fries. <gasps> She's doing it. She's gonna eat the food. No, Rebecca. Please, no. Don't. I don't know. Do you think I should eat it? Maybe I'm just gonna have like one that was more at the bottom. No! Oh, don't like my life. What was that? It sounds like there's a dog. I know that dog. Hey, Blackjack, you're in the program? Blackjack? He's homeless too? Blackjack is from the streets. He is gonna be super valuable for Rebecca. Hey, did she want one of these? I guess you do. What are you doing in the program? Look, we can use this. A blanket. See, he just found her a blanket. Oh, perfect. Okay, little guy, you know what? I might be homeless and you might be homeless, but I think we can work together. Come on. Okay, Blackjack, welcome to your new temporary home. I'll give you a little tour. We've got two garbage cans that did have some food, but you ate all the curly fries, yes. And everything else is rotten, so you can't eat anything else right now. But we have this picture, yes. This is my boyfriend. He's not here anymore. This house looks a lot different than her old house. I guess it works. She is covered. See, I told you we could work together. You found the blanket, and I did the rest. Yes, we're a good team, except I'm kind of broken homeless. I don't have any money. I want to keep you, but I don't know what I'm going to do. Look, there's extra cardboard. We need to make money. We've got this cardboard square right here. I think I have an idea. What do you think her idea is? Sam fam, comment down below. What's Rebecca's idea? Hungry for three, pregnant and homeless, with a baby on the way and a dog. Anything? Thank you, sir. Hello. Thank you. The baby and the dog. And oh, oh my gosh. Blackjack, look. We do work well as a team. It looks like we're going to be getting dinner tonight. What do you want? You want Jack in the Box? I kind of want Jack in the Box too. Let's get some food. And now it is time to present our success meal. We're not doing curly fries today. Oh yeah. You want a piece? Let's start off slow and easy. Hey, Blackjack, where are you going? Blackjack's running away. Blackjack used Rebecca for food. Just like the real world. I thought we were a team. We were homeless together. <laughs> now I'm back to being all alone, pregnant and homeless. <laughs> Blackjack left me! Blackjack! Well, program Blackjack. It's not okay. real Blackjack. You saw the sign. We actually made money, Blackjack yeah. and I. And hey, you are super successful yeah. inside of there. Daniel, I just don't know how I'm supposed to be successful. I mean, even with the money I made, that's not going to be enough for me to support myself and a baby. That's not even enough for a house. You can't just feed your baby Jack in the Box all the time, Rebecca. I think you just need to take it day by day, Rebecca, and look for opportunities. Maybe we can find an opportunity that will help pull you up out of this homelessness. At least the sign thing brought me a little bit of money, and I don't have blackjack. Rely on yourself. You can do this yourself. Okay, You've been Zam training for this, Rebecca. Zambian, we've got this. This is so much harder to be broke and pregnant than I thought, but we have to beat this program, so put me in, Daniel. Here we go. <sighs> What's this? Any help welcome. This sign must work, because look. Look at the money. I mean, I can eat for at least a week right now. Okay, she's on the streets. She's in a neighborhood, at I least. I don't like this. Nice looking car. I could definitely steal that one. What is that sus guy in the back doing? He's wearing a ski mask. Who is that? Who wears a ski mask in public like that? No, did you hear that? That guy's gonna try to steal that lady's car. To warn that lady. Excuse me? I don't have any money, sorry. Oh, no, no, no. I, I don't want any money. There's a guy and I, I think he's gonna try to take your car. He's standing right there. Oh my gosh. I'll stay here, don't worry. Do you see what Rebecca's doing? She's gonna save this woman. He's walking away. Okay, great. Thank you. You might have saved my life. Oh, it was no problem at all. You're such a smart girl. <sighs> Actually, I'm not that smart. That's what kind of got me into this whole mess right now. I'm pregnant and a teenager and homeless. I won't stand for that. I'm starting a hotel called The Color Pop and I need valuable, trustworthy employees. Maybe you could work for me. You want me to work for you? Yeah. And then I can pay you and you could have a room till you get on your feet. Really? You would do that for me? Yeah. Get in. Get in? Where'd you go? I hope she shows up for work. <gasps> Good job. Sam, fam, I am on my way up. 
I mean, obviously I was homeless and this is just the start, but this is so exciting. And, and she offered you a room at the hotel so you are not even homeless anymore. Okay, so maybe I actually can beat this program. Yeah, but you need to go back in this program, do well at this job, yes. and just do not get fired. Woo! I'm not gonna get fired. I'm Oh, Rebecca, welcome to ColourPop Hotel. Oh, that's a cool looking hotel. Thank you so much for having me. You look amazing in this uniform. Oh, well, thank you for giving it to me. Really means a lot. <laughs> so you're going to be working the front desk. Yeah, I can do that. Cool, let me introduce you to your coworkers, Max and Sean. Hi, I'm Max, Hi. living the dream, I'm trying to pursue acting life. Oh. It looks like she actually has one awesome coworker. Rachel Mendes? Sean, just saving up for a guitar. Oh, nice to meet you guys. What do you do? My name is Rebecca, and I, who's that? Oh, perfect, that's our hotel manager, Jack. Hey guys, another super day at the hotel. Good to see all my buddies today. <laughs> Good to see you, Jack. Scoob? Oh, how convenient, Daniel, put Scoob in the program. Is I, he gonna trap Rebecca? I didn't make this program again, please believe Maddie, me. Maddie, 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 he actually looks like a pretty nice guy. Jack is amazing, you're gonna love him. You are in great hands with okay. Jack. He's gonna tell you what to do today. Look, don't think of me as your boss, we're all buddies here. <laughs> oh, oh. Hello, this is Tina. Okay, I'll be right there. All right, thanks. So you are going to listen to what Jack has to say and I'll see you later, okay? Great. Yeah, I'm excited. <laughs> hey, you! Go clean the floors! You! Go clean the ceilings! Yes, Mr. Yes, check Mr. Check-in. No, he's not. No, he's not at all! He's not at all. Oh. And you, I've heard about you. Come with me. Okay. Hey! I didn't say you could sit. All workers stand. I don't care if you're pregnant. Oh, okay, sorry. What did you want to talk to me about? We finally get a lady here. Well, guess what? You're useless. Sir, I've never been talked to that way. You've never been talked to like this? Not even on the streets? How did you know that? I haven't told anyone. I know a lot about you and your precious little backstory. How you weaseled your way into this this job. How do you think your coworkers would like knowing that Tina's letting you live here rent free? No, 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 you don't have to do that. Don't make me send you back to those awful streets. <laughs> I'm homeless, but I won't be homeless forever. And I'm a really hard worker and I'll do whatever it takes to be good at this job. Have you ever had a job before? Well, not exactly. <laughs> That's what they all say. Well, guess what? Now it's time to clean my office. Stop Starting now, ending never. Well, Tina said I was working the front desk. Well, Tina's not in charge. I'm in charge. Start cleaning. Okay. He's trying to shame Rebecca for being homeless and pregnant? How mean. We need to keep an eye on this guy because this guy might hold Rebecca back from being successful. Okay, this isn't exactly going as planned. Tina made it seem a lot different than it really is here, but I've never had a job and I need to prove that I can take care of not only myself, but this baby that's coming into the world. So if I have to clean desks all day, that's fine with me. At least I have a job and at least I'll be able to provide for my child. Just need to get some money so I can get on my feet. He has a lot of money here. That's like $100,000 or more. I can't even imagine what I would do with $100,000. Why does the manager have so much cash out in the open? What's this doing here? Oh, this could really change me and my baby's life. She wouldn't take the money. She's a good person, right? Not because you wouldn't do it. But I can't do it. It's not worth it. I'll work my way up. I'll make my own money. Yeah, she didn't take Set it. Set it down. <laughs> totally fine. Yes. Okay, okay, you're done in here. Now go clean the bathrooms. Oh, I don't want her to clean the bathroom. Okay, and there. What the heck? She better be cleaning those bathrooms. You guys, I almost had to clean a bathroom. That's why I pulled you out. I did not want you to clean the bathroom. How does he know that I was homeless and pregnant? I mean, I didn't tell anyone in the program that I was. No, it doesn't make any sense. You guys, right now, I just need to stay focused. As long as I work hard in this job, I'll yes. move up and I can beat the program, okay? Right. Let's just get you back inside. Even if I have a mean manager, that happens to people all the time. Very true. All right, here we go. Oh, 
back at the hotel. Okay. Fantastic. Don't forget to give us a five star review on TripAdvisor. Thank you for some excellent service. You got it. Have a good day. Oh, it looks like I'm counting inventory in the lobby. So, chandeliers are good. Two dozen roses. Oh, hey, Rebecca, I saw you pointing there. You need some help? Oh, I'm just doing inventory, but um, actually I actually have to check the bottoms of these tables, make sure that they're good. Oh, you want me to lift that? I know that you're prego and everything. Oh. I've been working out, preparing for this big role I've coming up. Oh, what role? It's actually a commercial. My mom's hoping that she sees me on camera this time. Don't lift that. I got you. What do you need? I just have to check, make sure the legs are sturdy. Oh, yeah, let me lift it. Oh. Oh. Ah. I'm just going to check a few more things in here. Oh, I did that on a commercial one time. You have to fluff the pillow. Flip it, reverse it. Hey, can I get a little help out there? We have two new guests for check-in. Yeah, I actually just finished. I can be right there. You think they'd have like a bell or something. All right, sir, your room's all set. Go ahead and back there and check it out. All right, well, thank you very much. No problem, enjoy your stay. All right, perfect. Where's Max? He should be on his way. We have two new guests to check in. Okay. Right? Give me a little opportunity to train you on how to check people in. Perfect. Let's get started. Okay. Hey, Sean, come clean the electrical sockets in here. I don't think that you can even do that. You know what? what? I think you've got this. It's easy. Okay, I haven't checked anyone in before. Next guest, ma'am, sir, how Rebecca? are you? Well, what are you doing here? Rebecca, how did the baby? It's gone so big. Mom, Dad, what are you guys doing here? I'm treating your mom to a weekend at this new hotel. What are you doing here? I work here. You work here? Where are you living? I'm actually living here and working here. That doesn't seem safe. Well, isn't this what you wanted, Dad? I mean, you guys kicked me out. You told me I had to figure it out, and I am. Who's that behind, Rebecca? I'm trying to provide for myself and my future child. That Scooby's spying on her. You might be filming her as well? Okay, when Rebecca comes out of the program, we need to warn her about Scooby. Like, he might be the reason that she doesn't defeat the program. You guys are the ones that left me homeless on the street. I have no Jeep. I had to find food. I lived in a park and I didn't shower for a very long time. Wait, 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 wait. What do you mean no Jeep? The Jeep might have been taken. What? The Jeep's stolen? We're still paying that off. Okay, well, you should probably stop them because I have not had that Jeep for a while now. All right, honey, look on the bright side. She finally got a job. But look, what about the baby? You're just gonna live in this hotel and raise a baby? You can't do that. Dad, I'm gonna do whatever I have to do to make sure my my child is safe, okay? I'm doing the best that I can. I will not stand for this. This what? is ridiculous. Honey, grab your bags. We're out of here. We're not checking in. No, we're out of here. What? Mom. I'm sorry, sweetie. Mom, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing the best that I can. My parents, they just don't even care. Oh, that is you crying, Rebecca. You okay? Yeah, did Jack make you cry? He just made me cry. No, no, it's not Jack. I don't know if I can say it. I've never told anyone. Well, you can you can tell us. Yeah. Work family. Exactly. <laughs> okay. Earlier today, I didn't want to tell you guys this because I was ashamed. And I'm still ashamed, but I'm homeless. I, I don't have anywhere to live. And, and Tina, she met me and she gave me this job here. I'm living here temporarily, but I, I don't have a place to go other than here. And I don't know what I'm going to do. My parents just kicked me out. And those guests that were just here, those are my parents, the ones that kicked me out. <laughs> Sorry. Are you writing this down right now? Yeah, this makes a great song. I just don't know what rhymes with pregnant. If you make a music video, I could be Rebecca in it. Except for, I'm not pregnant. Or a woman. <laughs> oh, oh, hey, okay. Uh, uh, there, there. Hey, Rebecca, what's important now is that we are here for you. We have your back. Mm -hmm. We're your family now. Yeah, we'll, we'll be your dads. What? You really mean that? <clears throat> oh. We're dads now? Daniel, why would you not be nicer? Program, okay. hello. Rebecca, I don't know if you saw, but manager Jack was spying on you in the background when you were talking to your parents. Okay, yep. well, he already knows I'm pregnant and homeless. Whatever he got, I don't really care. It's not new information, you're right. So I just need to stay positive, stay focused, yes. and become successful. That's right. There we go. Where's Rebecca? <laughs> oh, there you are. Hey guys, what are we doing? Tina said we have 10 minutes to take photos for our Instagram in this hotel, so. What? Yeah. We're gonna just take a bunch of selfies. Oh! Like friend selfies. Yeah, friend selfies. First one. Yeah. Okay. Look at that fun photo shoot. What a family. I am going to capture these photos that they're taking. I'm going to put them on the Game Master Network app. So make sure you check it because those photos look fun. Hey, you're coming to my holiday party, right? Holiday party? Yeah, you have to. Yeah, it's going to be a blast. Yeah, of course. I would love to do that, you guys. Oh, quick, can you take some headshots of me? Sam fam, this is working out. It really feels like a family. Obviously, my parents are mad at me, but these two are my new family. It finally feels right here. Hey, you have to go to the next room. We don't have that much time. Right, right, right. Let's go. Yeah, Come on. yeah. All right. Oh, God. 
Oh! Hey, what's going on here? Stop uh -oh. this! Stop it! Stop it! What are you doing? Get it for back, Jack. Gina said that we could yeah. take photos in here for 10 minutes. I'm not here to talk to you about photos. I'm here to talk to you about something else. You're in trouble. Let's go! Oh, oh way to go, Daniel. Just set Rebecca up to trap her. I mean, first you leave her in there for so long, and now you're gonna get her in trouble? That's not what is happening. This yeah, is you not are. You're trying to trap her, Daniel. You are so sad. Who are you even working with? Stop, 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 stop! Okay, okay. Look, they're in the office. Let's see what's happening. <laughs> I got you. I have evidence that one of you stole some money from the hotel. And not just a little bit of money. Ten thousand dollars. Ten thousand uh, dollars? Jack, we would never do that. Jack. I don't even know what that looks like. I would not steal that. None of us would. Oh, really? Well, look at this. to black. I put the money down right after that. This doesn't look good. Yeah, it looks pretty guilty. You guys, I didn't take that money. I promise you. You have to believe me. Wait, the video just cut out. It cut to black. What happened? That it makes it look happened. like she took the money. She didn't take it. She set it right back down. Yeah, yeah. Frank her. A video is worth a thousand blurbs. Never trust a homeless person. If you needed help, you could have just asked us. Yeah, I mean, we would have figured out a way to make it work. You guys, yeah. I, I wouldn't steal $10,000. I mean, I looked at it, but I never actually took it. I'm gonna send this evidence to Tina. Please don't send this to Tina, please. You're fired. Fired? fired. I gotta pull her up. Yeah, and stay out. <gasps> you guys, I didn't do it. I didn't steal the money. We know. He did something to the video. He cut it off. And now I'm fired. How am I supposed to be successful if I don't even have a job? Exactly what I'm saying. I have no idea what to do right now. Free me out. Oh, I think I have an idea. What? You're gonna go back into the program and look for a wooden treasure chest. I'm gonna do a supply drop, okay? Just use whatever is in this treasure chest, okay? Get back into the program. I got a great idea. I need to prove that I'm innocent. This will help you do it. You need to find some evidence against him. Okay. So this will help you do it, right? Three, two. Better not be a trap. If this is not a trap, this is gonna work. <sighs> Put on my uniform. That's right, because I'm fired. But Daniel said wooden treasure chest. I need to look for a supply drop of wooden treasure chest. Oh, okay, this better be good. Maybe this is evidence to prove that I did not take that money. Daniel? Why would I need a pink jumpsuit? I'm supposed to be trying to prove my innocence. Hold on, Jack's office is pink. I guess this is time for a little hide and seek. Hide and seek in one color? Are you kidding me, Daniel? That's genius. Yeah, it's almost like you didn't know what was gonna happen oh, because on. you didn't create the no, program. Manny, just get over that and look, this is gonna work. money. All right, well, there is tens of thousands of dollars here, but that still will not prove that I didn't take the money. So what should I do? Oh, no, I have time. Yes, we got the money. Don't worry. I pinned it all on this homeless pregnant girl. So let's keep everything going with the plan, okay? Rebecca's filming this conversation. This can prove that she's innocent and Jack was framing her. Sam, did you see that? He framed me and now I have video evidence to prove that I am innocent and he is the one that took that $10,000. This is perfect. Now all I have to do is send this footage to Tina and it will prove my innocence. He's coming. He's coming. Hold on. I'll be there in one second. My stomach kind of hurts. Oh, did he just come into the room to fart? Ew. Oh. Oh. Get any funny ideas, Maddie. <laughs> Wait, what the heck? Wait. <laughs> Okay. She needs to send that message hey, to I'm sending a video! Oh, okay, fine! <laughs> Wait, what the heck? <gasps> Did the message go through? I can't tell. I had to pull you out before you got caught by Jack. Find it out right now. What's oh happening? Gosh, I don't know. Finally had proof to prove that I didn't take the $10,000 that he framed me. What do we have? Do we have it? Do we have it? I don't know, but I, it looks like if I put you back into the program, you will be at the hotel, so we should find out what's going to happen. Oh, no. Do you think I'm going to have a job again? I hope so. This is the only way you're going to find success and pass this program. You technically can only get fired once. Okay, well, if I don't have a jacket, that means I don't have a job. You're right. Good luck. Three, two, one. She has a job. What's this meeting about? 
Tina. Oh no, she doesn't have a jacket. And there's Tina, she looks mad. After everything I did for you, he told me what you did. I didn't steal the money. I promised Tina I would never steal anything from this hotel or you. Well, the video evidence says otherwise. I got the video you sent me. The video I sent you? Yeah, you set this all up. You're fired. What? No, no, she, she's the homeless person. Fire her. <laughs> You'll all be sorry. Yes, that means the message went through and it proved to Tina that Jack did steal the money. This is great. Rebecca's yes. innocent. Oh, yes. Yeah. Woo I told you guys I didn't steal the money. I didn't steal. I would never have stolen anything. I'm sorry, Rebecca. I, yeah. I'm sorry that we didn't believe you. We should have. It's okay. Rebecca, life hasn't been easy for you. You've not been dealt an easy hand, but you've always been a nice person. Thank you, Tina. Oh, um, I hear some guests at the front. Should I go check them in, Tina? Actually, manager Rebecca will check them in. Manager Rebecca! Oh. What? successful in this program. No more cleaning the electrical sockets. Yeah. Thank you so much. I promise I will not let you down. I won't let anyone down. I'm ready. I'm gonna go check them in. Okay. Oh, you guys, those electrical sockets are pretty dirty. Could you get to those? Oh, uh, man, I Come guess. On. Here I go getting shocked again. Hello, I am manager Rebecca. How can I help you guys? Dad, Rebecca, Tina sent us the video of what happened, and honey, we are so proud of you. What? It's hard for me to say, but I'm sorry, my little girl. I can't believe I kicked you out. I'm so sorry, and look at what you've done with your life. You're successful, you're a manager now. We're yes, so proud of you. so proud. Mom, Dad, I never thought I'd say this, but thank you. Thank you for making me grow up. I know now that I'm gonna be able to take care of this baby but I don't want to do it alone. I love you guys, I miss you guys, and I want this baby to know their grandparents. <laughs> we're here, we're here. You see that coming at all? This is so beautiful though, they're coming together. They're a family again. I love you guys. <laughs> you too. We love you. Thank you for everything. Tina, thank you for sharing all that information. You brought our family back together. I know how hard it can be to be homeless. I was homeless before I built this hotel. Tina, y you were homeless? Your daughter's an inspiration, and she's gonna be an amazing mother. Really? That means so much to me, more than anything. <laughs> ah! What is it? What happened? I think my water broke. Oh. Hold on, her water just broke. What? What's going what? on? What? No, what? sit her down, sit her what? down. Wait, wait, wait. Call 911, please. Oh, wait, we need ambulance. Oh, no. Take she oh, my Take she needs to speak to you. 911 needs to talk to Rebecca. That doesn't make any sense. 911? Why do they need to speak to me? <sighs> what? What is she looking at on the phone? I can't see it. It's glitching out. Oh, the watch in. 12, 18, 21. That must be the day of the grand finale for the candy queen. Oh, you're right. <gasps> Guys. You did it. You beat the program. I did it. We did it. But the phone call, the 911 phone call. Yeah, we got the date too. Of the grand finale? Yeah, what? it said 12, 18, 21 on our screen. Okay, so we know candy queen's plan. So Daniel was in line after. This wasn't a trap. Right? Hello? Oh, wait, wait, you guys, when I got the 911 call and I looked at the phone, it was a picture of the bathroom at the warehouse. Where did you picture that? I don't know. Maybe there's another clue that has to do with the grand finale or okay. the date. Yeah, we need to go to the warehouse and go to the bathroom. First, I gotta go to the bathroom. I 